Hello everyone and welcome back to This Is Real Life. I'm your host Sherry and on today's Skincare Saturday video, we're sitting in the dining room and I need every single one of you to run over to your junk drawer or your desk and grab a notepad and a pen because it is the beginning of the new year and I need your help. You are gonna help me pick the skincare things that we are going to test in 2022. I know, right? Let's get into it. P.S. Do you like my bun? I used the perfect bun. It is a little bit tricky. If you kind of look closely like right in there, you'll see like the weird mechanism that makes the bun. It's not like one of those mesh donut things. It's like this long thing that has a slit in it that you slide your ponytail in and then you roll, 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 and then it has hard wire in it so then you fold it on itself into a round circle. I haven't quite mastered it yet. This is my first time trying it. I don't know. I thought it was pretty neat. I got it at the Walmart for like $4.99. The perfect bun. What do you think? Yeah, this video is not about the perfect bun. It's about the skincare that we are all curious about in 2022. Now, I have a lot of bits and pieces of skincare that I have either just, you know, purchased wherever because I saw it at like the grocery outlet or the TJ Maxx or that I have gotten in, you know, an Ipsy subscription. I don't have full lines, but I have bits and parts. And so if we're interested in any of them, then I will purchase the other items to make a complete, you know, skincare regimen to test. And some of these things never even heard of but I'm curious to know if they interest you in any way we'll obviously read about them we'll read about the skincare line we'll see what they promise how long it's gonna take how fucking much they are you guys take your notes and then in the comments below you let me know like your first second and third choice that's how we'll start the new year in skincare testing okay so I have many interesting things I have a bunch of this I know it's ridiculous. And then I have some stuff here on the table. I would say my first thing that I'm kind of curious about is this right here. Now this company is called This Works. 24 hour skin solutions. Now I'm pretty sure I got this one item in an Ipsy bag. It says brighten up and forget about wrinkles with slow release of vitamin C and hyaluronic acid. Clinically proven to reduce the appearance of wrinkles in a panel of 23 subjects over a 28 day period. This works delivers clean targeted skin solutions that work in harmony with the body clock 24 hours a day. So curious, I'm going to guess and say, let's go to thisworks.com and see what else they have to offer and actually how much this My Wrinkles Eye Repair is. Okay, well, wouldn't you know it, they got a great domain name. It literally is thisworks.com. It seems that they use cookies on their website, so okay, fine. Accept the cookie, bro. No. Accept the cookie. No. They do have a category area and a concern area. Fine lines and wrinkles and age management. So for fine lines and wrinkles, they definitely have the My Wrinkles Eye Repair. This is regularly $56.00. It is on sale for $39.20 right now. This is suitable for vegetarians, so that's good. It says 90% of the panel said they liked the appearance of their skin immediately after using the product. 97% of the panel users said that their skin felt moisturized. 70% of the panel said that their skin felt plumper. Where's the percentage of the panel that said that they didn't have wrinkles anymore? They have this stuff called In Transit Camera Close-Up. It's a mask, moisturizer, and primer all in one for a long lasting perfect makeup finish. Reduces redness and the appearance of wrinkles, leaving skin looking and feeling naturally radiant. So that's good. Age management, it looks like they're still touting that. I think this is like their claim to fame as far as like wrinkles and age management are concerned. My Wrinkles Extreme Moisturizer, My Wrinkles Nighttime Moisturizer, both of those are $70. So if you guys want me to test this and more items by This Works, let me know. Looks like it would definitely be a 28 day test based on these promises and what we're gonna see and when we're supposed to see it. So yeah, I'm curious. What do you think? Next skincare line I'm kind of curious about and I have 
one thing from them. I think it's Dermalect Cosmeceuticals. This, what I have, is the Self Esteem Beauty Sleep Serum. This says it's a potent yet gentle anti-aging serum combining three active forms of amino acids. Overnight treatment effectively revitalizes dull looking skin, focus on fine lines, wrinkling, and large pores, great for age spots and uneven skin tone, multitasking facial and decollete applications. Now, all of those bullet points sound fucking wonderful. However, we're gonna definitely have to go to their website because nowhere on the box does it tell me like, see results in X amount of days. Okay, so right off the bat, exclusive offer, 10% off your purchase, Gur 8 The thing that they're really touting all over the homepage of their website is, oh, I thought it was this, it looks the same, but it's not. It's a smooth and supple lip mask that's all over the joint. It says resolutions and solutions, everything you need to start off 2022 best anti-aging lip treatment oh hell yeah we're gonna go we're gonna go we're gonna look at that three consecutive years dermalect wins best of in the esthetician choice awards i didn't even know there was such a damn thing so their smooth and supple lip mask is an instant lip quenching moisturizer will leave us obsessed it is $26. They have a crease concentrate, a wrinkle treatment that smooths out the appearance of facial lines and creases. Oh, this is one of those sites that I really cannot stand. It's like a Cindy Crawford situation. You can be a member and pay, I'm assuming a monthly fee, I'm not reading too deep into it, auto delivery basically, you get 15% off. So for the one-time purchase, this confidence crease concentrate is $80. Let's see what it does. Well, I will tell you, the women they have on here, they look just like me, just like you. I appreciate that. They're like, of an appropriate age to be advertising for a wrinkle crease concentrate smoother. So thank you Dermalect for that at least. It says pure vitamin A with a number of functions including reducing the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles, improving skin tone, and softening rough patches. They also have this Empower. They're just not cheap, but it's not like stacked skincare prices. Empower Anti-Wrinkle Treatment, a luxurious AM and PM wrinkle cream featuring six multi-peptides. This Self-Esteem Beauty Serum, which I have, which this is only $42. What is this? Must have anti-aging duo. It's a resilient wrinkle fighting set. Two full-size treatments. So you get the crease confidence and the, oh, okay. That is actually a good deal. So you get the anti-wrinkle treatment and the crease confidence for $129. Is that my price or is that the if I'm a fucking member price? I think that's my price. Okay, cool. Get lifted instant. Okay, I am mesmerized by this site. There's too much going on. I am intrigued by every fucking thing. Every time I click on something, move on something, smooth upper lip professional anti-aging treatment that has advanced ingredients for lip lines. Oh, we're getting that. We're getting that. And they also have this thing called Get Lifted Instant Facelift. It's only $44. What the shit is it? Protein rich egg whites combined to provide a firming and lifting facial. That's only gonna last like five seconds. I guarantee it. Okay, remember when I was just giving them props about having like age appropriate people? I go to this page for the instant facelift and this, this person on here is 27 tops. <laughs> I'm just saying, skin looks perfect. There's so much stuff. If you guys want me to test this uh, Dermalect, I will probably end up spending a pretty penny because they're speaking to me in all of the anti-aging buzzwords that they possibly could speak to me in. Ageless Retinol Kit, $65. High impact formulas to target fine lines and uneven skin tone. Ooh, that anti-aging lip treatment. It keeps lipstick from bleeding and make them from settling into fine lines. I'm into that. I do have an issue with darker lipstick bleeding, hence why I just wear chapstick all the time. So yeah, if you guys want me to get more stuff from Dermalect and test that out, let me know in the comments below. Next skincare brand that we may want to consider trying in 2022 is Vitabrid C12 Daily C Balancing Foam Cleanser. But on the website, the brand does have a bunch of anti-aging stuff. 
They have a face brightening cream, a wrinkle cream, a wrinkle serum, a dual drop serum. They have facial boosting water. This skincare out of the out of the three that we've gone over so far, this one seems the most reasonably priced. This um, Daily C Balancing Foam Cleanser is $32. Wrinkle Cream, a little bit pricey at 70, but the container looks pretty big. This person says, after three days in Joshua Tree, Newton's third law of motion was written all over my face. I can't. <laughs> oh, this is another one that has a paid membership worth $100 free. You get discounts, yada, yada, yada. Okay, so let's go to the wrinkle cream. That's really what we're here for, right? It says, a wrinkle fighting cream harnessing our unique formula with patented novel peptides, secret code P151. You guys know that song? You know that song? Helps reinforce the natural skin recovery process, improving deep lines and creases on the face and neck while tightening pores for younger, healthier looking complexion. That's pretty good. Let's check this wrinkle serum. Okay, so the wrinkle serum is 72. As I'm looking at the room, I was like, oh, this seems more moderately priced. Only some of the products seem moderately priced. These wrinkle ones, they're in the $70 range. This exclusively developed, weightless, highly effective serum is powered by our unique formulation secret code. There it is, secret code P151. Clinically proven to help target fine lines and wrinkles and smooth skin texture while refining pores for a firmer, resilient looking skin. I mean, it all sounds good, but nowhere on this site does it say like 3% of the people said they had no more wrinkles in two weeks. I don't know. I don't know about this one, but if you guys are curious and interested in me testing out this and more products from Vitabred C12, let me know in the comments below. Okay, the next skincare brand we can think about testing in 2022 is Kors. And this I have is their foaming cream cleanser. It is a Greek yogurt cleanser. That's all well and good. But this cleanser aside, if you go on their website, some of their best sellers are some wackadoo products that I've never heard of these ingredients used in skincare before ever. For example, they have a black pine 3D Eye Lift Super Serum, Black Pine Sculpt and Lift Serum, and they have a White Pine Mino Reverse, stop, I don't want your discount. Mino Reverse Deep Wrinkle Plumping and Age Spot Concentrate, that one sounds like the best one, and that is $65. This one says White Pine, White Pine, it's so interesting. Deepest of wrinkles, sagging, and age spots. Why yes, yes, Coors. How did you know you were speaking to me? It says, Our Remedy, a targeted anti-aging treatment designed for postmenopausal. Interesting. Okay, so this is for an older demographic in an ultra concentrated formulation to reduce the appearance of stubborn age spots and deep wrinkles. Guys, it's inspired by prehistoric trees. I, I can't make it up. Inspired by prehistoric trees in Pindus. It says from the peak of the Pindus mountains. We've captured, it's the whole secret, secret cantaloupe melon again. Come on, guys, we're not falling for it. But let me read on. We've captured the vitality of a 2000 year old tree. <laughs> You've got to be fucking kidding me. <clears throat> I'm sorry. Let me be more professional. We've captured the vitality of a 2,000 year old tree in our breakthrough white pine skincare. Well, what about the black pine? We're going to have to read about that. Thriving in extreme environmental conditions at the highest of altitudes, white pines contain powerful polyphenols that boost our collagen and elasticin and address the drastic loss in volume and hydration that comes with menopause. Okay, aside from them capturing the vitality of a 2000 year old tree, I like what their mission is, who they're targeting, because before and after menopause, your body is completely fucking different. 
So things that may have worked for you prior to may not work now. Not to mention the fact that after menopause, everything just goes to shit. Oh, and not, I wouldn't say, okay, not shit. Everything is just completely different. Gone is your collagen. Why does my face fucking sag to the floor? Cause gravity. There's nothing here to like hold it up in place anymore. Why does my neck look like a fucking turkey waddle? Cause gravity. Any sort of vitality that you had in your skin before menopause, exact after menopause. So for me, I definitely wanna try some of their stuff just because I think they've got a handle on the people that are really looking for anti-aging at this stage in life. That's what I think, just by my brief rundown. Now, mind you, we're looking at these, all of these products for the first time together. I didn't research anything prior to because I didn't want to come in with a like, ooh, I'm definitely trying this. No, I want us all to decide together what we're interested in seeing me test in 2022. I would say one of my votes would be for this one, but I'm curious to know what you guys think. I'm curious about the black pine, and I also want to know what tree or bush or shrub they harness the vitality from for these. Let's look at the Black Pine 3D Eye Lift Super Serum. It says, your skin, lines, wrinkles, and loss of tightness. Our remedy, a potent eye lifting serum that brings the elastic bounciness back to your skin, reducing the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles, visibly firming and lifting skin. That all sounds great. This too is inspired by prehistoric trees. It's the prehistoric Greek pines that survived through the ice age and are able to thrive through the production of protein within itself that helps boost our skin's own natural collagen and elastin. We work closely with the Greek Forestry Association and extract the most potent parts of the bark, allowing the pines to grow and flourish. Okay, so it's not like they're harming any trees, I guess. Maybe, who knows? Oh, oh, we got some benefits. We got some benefits. 97% saw a lifted upper eye area after 28 days. 94% saw reduced appearance. Okay, I'm trying to be impartial. Don't feed off my excitement. You vote for the skincare line you want me to test, not for the one you think I'm most excited about. But this says 94% saw reduced appearance of crow's feet wrinkles after 28 days. But again, it's pretty good. I could say anything on a fucking website. I could say this, this mocha right here, drink it in the morning, wrinkle free in the night. So yeah, just because they say it on the website doesn't mean it happens. That's why we're going to test it. Let's just really quickly, I know we spent a lot of time on this Coors line, but it's it's the ancient pine trees. This black pine sculpt and lift serum at $65. 100% saw firmer, more lifted skin appearance after 56 days. 100% experienced an improvement in skin's texture and radiance after 28 days. And 90% saw a visibly reshaped facial contour after 56 days. I mean, they have tons of stuff, guys. This could be another one of those sites where I'm like, I got this, I got this, I got this. And $7 million later, we have skincare that may or may not work. But yeah, if you're interested in me testing this and other products by Coors, let me know in the comments below. So this next one, I don't know, I'm torn. It's all natural, I know. And you know, we tried like Burt's Bees, all natural skincare. Now all natural, I don't know. I feel like my face, my wrinkle depth, my situation here requires like hardcore motherfucking chemicals. However, I understand that not everybody's face can handle retinols and things like that. This herbivore brand is all natural. Now this product that I have here is a deep moisture glow oil. This here says it's supposed to reduce the appearance of wrinkles. So when you go onto their site, it does say that Herbivore believes in the power of natural to bring tangible results we can see and feel. They do have a Bacuchial Retinol Alternative Soothing Serum, some moisturizers, 
Their price point is about like 50, 60 bucks. They do have like these little kits, like acne prone, anti-aging face oil for dry skin, beauty face oil for combination skin, exfoliating serums. Give me the anti-wrinkle. I just, you know, I prefer when sites are like wrinkly, buy this. Don't make me hunt for it. Phoenix Rose Hip Anti-Aging Face Oil. Oh wow, it's $88. It says, like a phoenix. Okay, some of the writers for, for these descriptions, props, I'm just saying. Like a phoenix being reborn from the ashes, renew your skin's look and feel with a blend of Lux Botanical Oils and COQ10 rehydrates and revitalizes dry skin or any skin in need of replenishment and moisture renewal. It says pair it with the Amethyst Deep Puffing Face Roller. First review, love, love, love. Oh wow, where has this product been all my life? My dry skin loves this. Amazing. Okay. I, I'm sorry, I'm not getting as excited about this one. It's just because it's all natural. It's like, I just find it really hard to believe that some fucking hemp oil and rose hip oil are gonna take away my deep lines and my crow's feet. But maybe I'm wrong. So I don't know if you guys think that this might work and we should try it. Let's look at the sets. They have a moment to escape set, a moment of clarity, a moment to reflect. Just what does that mean? Let's see, moment of clarity. What the, what does that mean? What's moment of reflection? Now the moment of clarity set is $50. Ooh, target concerns for this little kit are congestion, dullness, redness, fine lines, and wrinkles. What do you get? You get a mask, a blue tansy BHA mask. You get the Bacuchio Retinol Alternative Smoothing Serum, and you get a lapis face oil. So yeah, if you guys want me to try a natural situation for fighting our fine lines and wrinkles, let me know if herbivore is something you want me to check out. Okay, I've got a couple pricey, pricey skincare brands in that little basket right there, and this is one of them. Sometimes I get these in my Ipsy, and it's like, ugh, I don't know if I could commit because their shit's so expensive. It's 111 Skin Rose Gold Radiance Booster. It says this booster is formulated with rose and pure gold, well it better damn well be because of the price, to enhance the natural radiance of skin for a a coveted, dewy, lit from within complexion. 111 Skin, they got a lot of shit. They even say, I mean like right when you go to their website, it says like a luxury skincare brand. Concerns, anti-aging, here we come. Discover our range of products formulated with clinical levels of active ingredients to brighten the complexion and combat both premature and advanced signs of aging. All right, so. I don't even know why I'm bringing this one up, you guys. Seriously, I just re-looked at the prices. Please don't make me buy this. I mean, I will if you really want me to test it, but if I test it and it works, that means you guys are gonna have to buy it too. First off, we've got a Space Defense Bright Eye Lift Gel. It's $190, but just wait, that's like the cheapest. It's a powerful under eye solution that reduces the visible appearance of fine lines, wrinkles, and under eye darkness. You know what? For that price, if you don't have fucking results in a timely manner, uh-uh. Let's see. No, they don't say what you'll see. How can you not tell me? I know why you cannot tell me because you don't want me to get pissed off that I spent $190 on something that doesn't work. I wonder if I zoom in on that packaging if it says, no, it doesn't. Okay. Then they have a Y Serum? Repair Serum? It's a beauty award winner and it's $350. Harnesses are unique NACY2 trademarked by the way. Formula, the result is a reduction in the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles, plumper looking skin, and a rejuvenated complexion for $350. And they also have a Y Therum Day Cream. They do have just a face mask like a paper sheet mask, Celestial Black Diamond Lifting and Firming Mask for $35. They have the Celestial Black Diamond Eye Cream for $300. Uh, the little eye patches that go like this for $15. They have a Black Diamond Retinol Oil. I don't know, the Black Diamond stuff looks pretty cool. I mean, it's either the Black Diamond or the Y Therum. I think that's where we would go. Highly concentrated night treatment contains 1% retinol, 
to resurface uneven skin texture and diminish the appearance of age spots, fine lines, and wrinkles. Yeah, I think Black Diamond might be where it's at for us in our 111 skincare journey. It's expensive, but I'll buy it for you guys if you really want me to test it out in 2022. Let me know if you want me to test this and other products by 111 Skin in the comments below. Next up we have Ole Henriksen, I guess. Oi, this guy right here. This happens to be the Banana Bright Eye Cream. This skincare line has a bunch of vitamin C stuff. What I thought might be interesting because we only really tried vitamin C like one time in our lives. I feel like A, some of it was homemade and B, most of it was drugstore. So this would be a higher end line and they have this vitamin C thing called Truth Serum. The one ounce is $52. This potent vitamin C collagen serum helps brighten and firm the skin as it delivers all day hydration. It says it firms, brightens, fights visible signs of aging and all day hydration. In an independent consumer study on 35 women for over eight weeks, 97% agreed this product smooths skin, 94% agreed this product leaves skin soft, 85% agreed this product improves skin radiance, 80% agreed this product creates healthier looking skin. Let's see, what do I have right here? This is the Banana Bright Eye Cream. This is $40. It brightens and instantly targets fine lines and wrinkles, delivering age-defying results. Age-defying. Collagen boosted, it firms and deeply hydrates even as it feels deliciously lightweight, making this your go-to vitamin C eye cream that promises to help revive and illuminate the entire eye area. 97% agree this product smooths skin. 94% agree this product leaves skin soft. Where are the percentage of people that say that they didn't have any wrinkles? I don't understand. It's an age-defying eye cream, but nobody's talking about their wrinkles. The only thing they have to say about it is it makes their skin soft. I don't know, Ole. However, they do have a lot of vitamin C products. You know, vitamin C is supposed to be good for our skin, so maybe we wanna give it a try again. I'm not quite sure. What do you guys think? There also is a skin test, so, you know, if you guys want me to try this one, we'll take the skin test. They actually have a Let's Get Luminous Brightening Vitamin C Essentials set. And it looks like you get three trial size vitamin C products there. They have Truth Juice Daily Cleanser, a Day Bright and Smooth Night Vitamin C and Acid Serum Full Size Duo for $100. They even have a Wrinkle Blur Bacuchial Eye Gel Cream for $49. So some interesting things by by our buddy Ole Henrik Henriksen. Ole Henriksen. So if you guys would like me to try this and some other products, let me know in the comments below. Now this skincare line, I feel like we talked about me testing this brand, I think in 2020, it's Murad. Yay! And they do have a whole line of anti-aging and it's actually their line that comes in this green packaging. This right here is the Renewing Eye Cream. It says it firms and visibly reduces dark circles and wrinkles, but they have have a whole bunch of shit in that green packaging. Cleansers, toners, exfoliators, serums and treatments, moisturizers, serums and treatments. Let's just take a look. Again, I mean, uh, I feel like I went to sleep and woke up and every single skincare thing on the planet went up in price. They have a targeted wrinkle corrector that is $78. When you can't make it to the dermatologist for a filler, this powerful peptide meets hyaluronic treatment virtually erases uh-huh, I'm sorry. It virtually erases, I'll buy it right now. Virtually erases the look of wrinkles by visibly smoothing and reducing wrinkle intensity instantly. I'm sorry, I'm clicking to learn more. It says it's a new product. Works like an instant filler. We've tried those before, guys. Flooding wrinkles, even deep set stubborn lines to plump smooth and reduce wrinkle intensity on, we're buying this, it's $78. But seriously, they're saying all the buzzwords that we know are gonna fail. Instantly, on contact, I don't know, Murad. It says, <laughs> Okay, they covered their asses. Literally, there's a little asterisk at the bottom and it says, instant results are not permanent. 
Okay, good to know, at least you're being honest. It says 100% showed visible improvement in wrinkles instantly, and that is huge and in bold, but with two asterisks next to it. Oh, it says right here, the two, okay, it says frustrated by wrinkles, but not ready for the needle. This proven wrinkle fix instantly fills and blurs deep set etched in lines and creases so they're practically undetectable. It's preventative too. Continued use boosts skin's hydration levels to help resist future wrinkles. Then right under that, there's the two asterisks. These are glabella lines, and it does say AKA 11s. So they're talking about right here. Guys, I'm trying to not get excited about it, but maybe, just maybe, we should try Murad in 2022. In particular, this targeted wrinkle corrector. I'm just saying, even though it's $78, pretty damn expensive, where to apply? 11s between the brows or the glabella lines. I had no idea that's what that was called. Forehead lines, crow's feet, sides of mouth and top of mouth. This is like the only thing, I wonder, I mean, I know that it says it happens instantly and I also know that it says that the results are not permanent. However, it does say if we continue to use it and use it and use it, that maybe we'll see a reduction in our lines over time. It's all of the areas that we wanna target. As long as we apply it properly, we'll see instant results. It says so right here. And you know me, I will apply it properly. Oh shit. They have before and afters, they're insane. There's an immediately after, she's fucking smooth. And then there's a four week after, where you can tell she still has four headlines, like, you know, these ones right here, but they're much, much fainter than they were in the beginning. So that says 88% agree facial expression lines look smoother after four weeks. So even though it says you get instant results, it's one of those, if you do use it over time, four weeks in particular, that we should see untouched real results. Yeah, they're claiming a lot. They're claiming a lot. I don't know why we didn't, it's because there's so many damn skincare stuff. It's like, I only have a year and I only have one face. We didn't get around to it when I first brought it up. So maybe this year is the year for Murad. I'm just saying. Rapid collagen infusion. Reduce the look of fine lines and wrinkles in two hours. They have a replenishing multi-acid peel. Accelerate cell renewal by 33% in seven days while nourishing skin to prevent dryness and reduce irritation. That's $68. Kind of looking good. I don't know. What do you guys think? Should I test this and other products? In particular, targeted wrinkle corrector? Let me know in the comments below. All right. Next up, we have something pretty bougie. Part of me is like, it's just super, super hype. Charlotte Tilbury's Magic Cream. Charlotte Tilbury makes a bunch of shit. Makeup, skincare, gifts, whatever. So when you go to Charlotte Tilbury's website and you go under skincare, there aren't a lot of things to choose from. She's got this Charlotte's Magic Cream, which is like your daytime moisturizer. Then there's a Charlotte's Two-Step Beautiful Skin Routine. The Charlotte's Magic Serum Crystal Elixir and her Magic Night Cream. We've got like four-ish products to choose from. Part of me wants to just test this on its own because I really do feel like people just say it works because it's expensive and it's by Charlotte Tilbury and it's a lot of hype and a lot of gimmick and not a lot of bang for our buck because this 50 milliliter moisturizing magic cream is $100. Instant turnaround moisturizer for hydrated, glowing, plumper looking skin. It says magic cream is my best selling, it's all that shit. In one hour, hydration increases by 213%. No. Appearance of fine lines and wrinkles are reduced by 27%. Skin appears firmer by 200%. Skin appears more elastic by 152%. See, it's just here. I just don't believe it. Like, how are you getting these percentages? 152% skin appears more elastic? How are you measuring that, Charlotte? I don't know. I think it's a lot of hooey. But I also am curious, I do wanna know, is this so fucking great? Everybody's dying over it, is it worth $100? It says 96% saw a reduction in fine lines and wrinkles, I don't know. But this right here is $100. This is just what we would use in the day. 
The night cream is $145. She does have a recommended skincare routine where I guess we might as well, we would do it. It would cost us $8 million. But step one is her magic cream. Step two is her magic eye rescue. Step three is the night cream. And step four is the crystal elixir lip oil. Oh, there's step five, cryo recovery eye serum. Oh, and step six is a cryo recovery mask. It's one of those LED masks. We could test all that shit out. Just let me know. Do you guys want me to test Charlotte Tilbury's magic shit and see if it's worth the hype and worth the money? Let me know in the comments below. Another skincare brand is this Hey Honey. I happen to have the Open Your Eyes Lifting Eye Serum. I feel like they are another natural skincare line. It's a light, fast acting serum that revitalizes the appearance of your entire eye contour to deliver a bright, rested look. So if you go onto their website, their about us says, as busy people, we struggle to find the balance in our lives, juggling long to-do lists and keeping a relentless pace. Dealing with stress, lack of sleep, and exposure to harmful environmental factors means that our skin ends up paying the price. I mean, I like everything that they say right there. They kind of say like my mantra. As a result, our skin is constantly changing and we need versatile solutions to treat the conditions that dull and prematurely age our skin. I mean, I like that. So they do have CC cream, a good morning honey silk facial serum. They have a honey day and night moisturizing cream for $50. It's so funny because like some of their products seem really reasonably priced. And then they have a good night royal honey facial moisturizing replenisher, $51. A daily makeup remover for face and eyes for $32. So it's like, Hmm. And then they have a three-step beautiful aging routine for $157. Target signs of aging to provide noticeably smoother, healthier looking skin that's hydrated and supple. And it includes, it's called ACIT. It says rejuvenate and revitalize dull, depleted skin with signs of aging. Boosted up honey and hyaluronic acid rich moisturizer addresses both premature and advanced signs of aging as it targets the production of collagen and elastin. And then we have a royal honey facial moisturizer for all mature skin types. Three products for 160 bucks doesn't seem bad. It doesn't look like they have like 97% of saw this in. We'd just be flying by the seat of our pants on this one. But their products do look interesting. Um, I want to see this. Oh, Ageless Revitalizing Firming Cream. It is designed to rapidly diminish the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles. I don't know. Hey, honey, have you guys heard of it? I hadn't until I got this Open Your Eyes Lifting Eye Serum in my Etsy bag. So, yeah, if you're interested in me trying out Hey, Honey, this product as well as some other products, let me know in the comments below. So yes, we went, what did we review? We reviewed a lot of shit. Eight, 10 things, I think, that are all really good potentials for 2022. These, like I said, these are one-off things that I've just, you know, gotten an Ipsy, collected, you know, from the TJ Maxx, what have you. But if there is something else that we did not review here that you would like me to try, please leave it in the comments below. You know what I want to try too? Have you guys seen it? I feel like it's always on like a YouTube commercial, like a skippable ad that I never skip because I'm so intrigued. They're like these little plastic crescent moons that you put on your eyelids, you stick them on, and they're supposed to take away your hooded eyelids. If you guys know what I'm talking about and you want me to test those, remind me of what they're called in the comments below so that I can get them. And then you're supposed to be able to like, like wear makeup over the top of them and no one's supposed to know that you have these crazy plastic crescent moon stickers shoved up in your eyelid. I'm dying to try them. I know it's not a permanent solution, it's not a cream, it's not a whatever, but what if they did kind of work and you could just wear them to special events or something just to lift your, give your eyes a little lift? I'm just saying. If none of these products that we went over today sounds like anything you want me to test, and you want me to test something completely different that I haven't mentioned, maybe never even heard of, if you want me to go back and test like some more Aveeno or some Rock or whatever, let me know in the comments below and I'll probably test it. So 
If you like this video, please be sure to give it a big thumbs up. If you haven't done so already, please subscribe to the channel. Be sure to ring that notification bell so that you are alerted to all of the Skincare Saturday videos I push out. Yeah, you're not gonna wanna miss these tests, so make sure you ring the notification bell so that you don't miss any of the Skincare Saturday videos I push out every other Saturday at 9 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. Be sure to share this video with your family and friends. Let them also tell me what they'd be interested in me testing over 2022. If there's something that you've seen, an advertisement, something in a store, whatever, that's piqued your interest that you think could possibly maybe work to reduce like the 11s, our crow's feet, maybe something for our dark spots. Let me know, put it in the comments below. And as always, thanks for hanging out.